Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. Uh, today I wanted to show you something extremely different that I'm doing. This is a project I'm doing for someone else. Um, and at the present moment, we could not last in this area, these stones, so we have had to go the traditional method of burning the stone and having it crushed. So right now we're in the process of um, burning the, and um, the stone is now being crushed. And this is the stone we're also going to use for the foundation of this property. So it's quite laborious, as you can see. They've got to break the stone, and after they break the stone with heat, I'll go and show you how they're heating it up. They also then come and have the, someone who then spends the whole day crushing it, as you can, as you can see currently. So this is not a very slow. It's a very slow and tedious process, but it's the only way we could do it without damaging people's houses. As you can see, we are very close to people's houses and without blasting and without making a lot of noise. So what they would do is they heat up the, the stones, these um, bits and pieces. So what they're doing here, they heat up the stone using firewood. After they heat, um, heat the stone, then they take a 10 pound hammer and start breaking it into pieces. And after they've broken it into pieces, then it goes to the person who's crushing it. So this has now, this is process has now started. This is day number two in this process. And we are hoping that this process will, will lead to more fruitful things. For as we are at least looking at about five tons, five, five cubic tons of stone, of crushed stone, by the time this stone is crushed um, this is what we can say is the local and easiest method of crushing stones without having to blast them without having to use chemicals without using any other processes this is the natural and easiest way of doing this process so this is going to take us um, the guys have said at least a week to finish at least the burning and making the stones into smaller chunks and then after that it will take about another three weeks for them to then crush them to become small gravel so i'm hoping this is something that i would would talk more about because as i said i had another project which was going on which is personally mine but this is personally someone else's project but i've also got a project in the same area for somewhere where I am also about to start building. I have just purchased the land, but I have not done anything on that land yet. So it's a work in process. I've not dug, I've not done anything, but I will most likely show you just a piece of land. All that is there right now is that it has been cleared. After it has got cleared, we have now gone into the process of, um, there is now, the council has added water into the area. So we now we know have water. Electricity is the only thing that is missing. But I wanted to show you that this because I am doing this project in, in hoping that the stones which I crush from here will then go to my to our to my stand where, where I will show you in due time. So just wanted to show you the local way of crushing stones, burning stones, and coming up with um, quarry that is then used for for foundations and for other things that we use quarry um, for but this is the local method of doing it using heat heat and pure <laughs> brute force of a hammer and after that hammer we then they crack the stones after cracking them they make them cool down after cooling then they crush them using the nine the small little pound hammer as you saw at the beginning of the of the clip this is brute force of of stone crushing but hey, it's effective and it is less expensive this process of um, creating this stone so i hope to keep you up in date with this one and um, as i said also this is another project that is mine which i'm doing on behalf of someone else and the person said they didn't want the stone so i've decided that i would take the stone on their behalf whilst they just want a clear piece of land i would then take the stone and use it for my for my stand so 
hope you like these things and hey we say the the traditional way may not be brute force but it works as you can see this gentleman hard at it and i will give you an update as we go along thank you very much